Seal Kit Replacement Instructions for MixRite 3.5 Before replacing the seals on MixRite, turn off the water supply and verify there is no pressure in the pipe. Start by releasing the hose nut from MixRite and pulling the suction tube out. Then, remove the bottom nut, gently pull out the suction check valve and open the cylinder latch nut. Close the adjustment sleeve nut completely to expose the cylinder and pull the cylinder out. Remove the cylinder seal adjuster nut and the cylinder seal adjuster. Remove the old suction seal and rinse the seal base. Place a new seal, minding its orientation. Place back the cylinder seal adjuster and close the cylinder seal adjuster nut. Apply silicone grease to the o-ring on the new cylinder and insert it halfway into the pump. Align and insert the ring with the gaps in the cylinder housing, then push the entire part to place. Open the adjustment sleeve nut and place back the cylinder latch nut. Apply silicone grease to the check valve o-ring and insert it back to place. Place back the bottom nut and reattach the suction tube. In case the suction tube is old or dirty, it is advised to replace it with a new one. Disassemble mix right by removing the top cover and pulling out the engine unit. To remove the piston, first verify the engine rod is pressed up, then, using pliers, Give the piston adjuster a quarter turn clockwise and pull out the piston. Do not touch the piston itself with the pliers. To remove the engine's top seal, gently pull out the seal using long nose pliers. Place a new seal onto top of the engine, minding its orientation. To remove the engine's bottom seal, gently pull down the seal using long nose pliers. Place a new seal onto bottom of the engine, minding its orientation. Apply silicone grease to the two new seals. Reassemble mix right by inserting back the piston and giving it a quarter turn counterclockwise to lock in place. Insert the piston through the center of the spider, verify the o-ring is set in place correctly and close the top cover. Remember to activate the pump and set the dosage to maximum. Run the pump until it is filled with additive, and only then set the desired dosage.